Hey guys, welcome back. It's me, XR Hammer, and I'm playing Dragon Quest Builders 2. So, in the last episode, we uh, we got quite a bit done. Okay, we rescued the uh, the old potato patch, and we uh, learned how to make spike traps. And as you can see, I threw the rest of them down. I um, yeah, I also went off and did a little bit of farming. I've now got 299 marble, just so I could get some castle walls. All right, and for your castle walls, it's just marble. It's two marble for ten castle blocks. It's a fair trade-off, in my opinion. All right, but I didn't know how many I'd need, so I went and got lots. <laughs> As you do, okay? So, I also put two extra furnaces down here, just so I can have two doing constant iron and one for steel whenever I can, if that makes sense. Okay, so now... I believe I am building up this area. Yes. I need to put some uh, castle wall down when I actually hover over the block. Because, you know, it makes sense not to do that straight away. Right. And I also need a door. Where are my doors? Here we are. Right. So I'll put it this way so that it opens in like all the others. Smash that block just because I didn't like it. <laughs> do I need... Yes, I do need a... Uh, See, it's a third tier from the inside, but not... Uh, from the outside. No, from the inside. Yeah, I am right. Ooh! I literally blocked him out with that. That was amazing. High five. Beautiful. Right, so now... That's beautiful. That's done. That's golden. But it does now mean that I might have to move all of these spike traps down there a little bit. Otherwise, the skelly bobs aren't going to be uh, utilising them. <laughs> yeah. You know. It's fine. It's a good trade-off. Look at them. They just never stop. I had to put them all the way down there. Madness, I tell V. Madness. Right. Let's collect them. And send some more going. How many have we got? I'll send... I'll send another ten going. Just for now. Just because you never know if you're going to need your iron. Right, so who do I need to talk to? Ah, oh, there she is. Hi, Anessa. Self-disciplining. <laughs> Just sat in the corner near enough. Right. Hmm. Oh. A traitor. They're still on about that. Hmm. Anyway. It'll be fine. I'm just a builder. Right. Oh, hello, Jerome. Alright. A war room. A map. An embellimic... Uh, 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 yeah. Alright. <laughs> Let's go and have a look. So, we need... One of these. An emblematic table. It's an extravagant table. Right. Uh, we need a map. And a couple of these tiny soldiers. Which are beautiful. I'm pretty sure I had unlimited for all of these. Grass fibers, wood, yeah. <laughs> Brilliant stuff. Right, so we need a war room. Let's... Uh, rebuild this beautiful area. Just like so. Very nice. And then I'll pop that down. Wow, that map's huge. And then pop one there. I feel like putting one just above it like that. There we go. Small war room. I'll take it. What? Hey? What's wrong with you, old boy? Come here, talk to me before you uh, fall over. <laughs> Gadzooks. Oh, is he still on about it? Ugh, traitors, really. Uh, well, they're all pretty convinced, aren't they? Oh, Zara. Hello, Zara. Of course I remind, remember who you are, remind. <laughs> yes, I remember who you are. Hmm... So she wants me to equip them with iron swords, does she? 
I've already equipped Doom. <laughs> Just because, you know. Yeah. I had them. They were there. Right. Ooh, 15 in this one. Woohoo! What a winner. Right. So. She says iron. I'm going with steel. Just because they're just so much better. And your people like... It actually feels like they're helping you out. If that makes sense. Right. Now, the only bad thing is... Is I cannot remember who I equipped. He doesn't want one yet. She does not want one. He definitely does not want one. He was just chilling in the water. Uh, cunning Cadet. Yes, you can have one. Fierce Fighter. May have already have had one. Uh, Anessa. Have you got one? And Jerome, maybe? Oh, no, he already had one. We're all good. Right. Has Zara got one? I'm not sure. Is it the rest of the others? I can't see the others. Yes, it is. So she's got one. We're all good. We're all good. They now have steel swords. Which is good. It's very good. Right, let's talk to Anessa. Um, yep, yep, yep. I've already done that. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Anessa. Uh, the perks of being ahead, eh? <laughs> right. I've already done that as well. This this is a bigger a bigger bit of a uh, building. I remember this bit. Look at it. <laughs> it's huge. Luckily for me, it's just the outer walls. But it's still quite a feat. Right, and I do believe it's that way round maybe. I think it might well be. I'm not 100% sure. It might be that way round. Either way. Yeah. This bit's going to take a little while. Especially being under constant attack. Which really sucks. So, how many more doors do I need? Three. Do I have three doors? I have four. Look at that. I'm so on point. And how many... I need a few more castle wall. Right, so... I'm going to... Trudle off and make some castle wall just here and then what I'm going to do is uh, crack on build these defences and I'm going to speed it all up because I'm going to be under some heavy attack so yeah I'll speed it all up and I will see you all when I'm finished with it And complete. Right now, it wasn't as bad as I thought. Right, there were a couple of moments where it's just like, oh, just please stop. Just like they all ran away, and I thought, you know what? I might have a couple of moments. It might be fine, and then no. Literally, as soon as they ran away, they come back. It's like, just what is going on? Honestly, right? So irritating. Right, let's talk to Anessa. I'll disturb her. <laughs> right. Um, okay. Yes, that's that's the typical plan, your majesty, is to make it rise from the ruins. Right. This is brilliant. Now, also, <laughs> so look, I know this from experience. I am going to move some of these uh, spike traps, or not so much move them, I'm going to make some new ones. And pop them outside of that castle wall. Because they don't really get through anymore. I mean they, they can. Don't get me wrong. But 
it's not very often they do. Alright. So, yeah, what I'm going to do is quickly make some more. Uh, I reckon 150 will do. <laughs> uh, something like that. It'll be fine. Right. So, yeah, while he stood there like that, hopefully they won't spawn in. If I'm really lucky. Alright, and then what I can do is... Uh, Just decorate the front bit like this. Uh, I'm not going to throw them all down, obviously. I'll finish them off on ca off camera. But for now, I think I might be rather well advised in throwing some down. Yes, I mean, it's not a necessity. It's really not. But for me, I just prefer doing it. You can get away with not having to put any more spike traps down after your initial 30 down here, was it? But still, it's a bit... It's just not enough for me. All right. So, let's uh, talk to Malroff and we'll start this base defence off. It's school smashing time. <laughs> I love Malroff. They should have let me voice him. Ah, yes, look. Here we go. The jumpy jumpies. Alright, they, uh, they have an acquired taste, but at least they're not as strong as the skeletons. <laughs> and they jump straight over into the spy traps because they're still rather foolish. Like so. <laughs> well, they're meant to jump over. There we go. They're a bit slow. You know, they're not 100% sure what their job is yet. <laughs> well, my defense went down. Oh dear. Right, but again, look, this is... I should really have just put it in the middle, but if I come this way... Easy kills. Look, I don't really have to risk myself. It's a bit cheaty, but... Well, it's not really cheaty, because they give you the spike traps. You may as well utilise them, right? In my opinion. Use what you are given. Oh, wow. Look at this dude, he's huge. Oh, let's co-op <laughs> degrace to him. Come on, jump over. Jump over, dude. There he is. See you later. Big donk on the head. Wow. He's gone. Bye, dude. <laughs> wow. Wow. He did not last very long, did he? Do you see what I mean? Look, if I was to stand there and attack him normally, that would take me forever. But, by the time I've got these extra 85 spike traps down, it will no longer be a problem. Right? They will dispatch of themselves. A victory! Super high five. And don't come back. He did. Headhunters. That's their names. Fierce and warriors. Who like to jump. Alright, let's talk to Anessa. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> really? You do look a bit like Santa, but we're brown beard. Uh, magical traps. Ooh. Interesting. Ah, oh, see, look, the king's been holding out on us. There's floorboards here, you see. Oh, hello. <laughs> Good timing, man. I got loads. Wow. Very nice. Thank you very much, game. RNG liked me for a change. <laughs> right, here we go. Let's go down here. We'll open that. What have we got? Ooh. Is this zap fire? Yes, yeah, zap fire. And gold ingots. Very 25 gold ingots. Wow. I'll take you with me, because I'm not running all the way back down here. Every time I want to use it. <laughs> Talk to Anessa. Here comes Santa. <laughs> Ooh, very nice. Uh, zap traps. Magic crystals. Oh, Zara seems to know. Magic crystals to do so. And they are through that 
graveyard looking area. <laughs> Doesn't look the greatest, does it? Alright. But apparently we need to go that way. So, let's pop this down just about here. That should be... For Ooh, the room gets a bit fancier, does it? I can dig it. Right, let's just send... Yeah, let's send six more going and then we're going to have to stop on the uh, stealing at front, I think. Just for a little while until these are done. And I need to eat real bad. Alright. <laughs> I wonder if Matey Boy's been harvesting then. Uh, I, could, I would imagine not, as there's not a lot to harvest, is there? Right, let's get rid of all of these blocks, just so it looks... Somewhat nice. I might smash these out as well. Right. Is there any headhunters in this pack? There is. Oh, dear. Right. So how many do I need? Oh, just... Oh, fair enough. Not that many. I do need to make some classic columns, though. Don't I? Here they are. Beautiful. So I make 110 of them because I can. Ah. <laughs> uh. Naturally, why else would I have found all that marble? To not use it? Pfft. I don't think so. Right, so, now my, uh, oh, I leveled up, right? <laughs> that happens a lot on this map. It just happens a lot. Uh, it's so random. Uh, you don't even notice your XP bar going up. Steel shield. Very nice. Right, so, yes, as my next adventure, or my next quest, means going that away and adventuring somewhere over there-ish kind of thing, I'm going to uh, end this episode off here, and then we'll have a nice fresh start at it. So, yeah, guys, I really hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to leave a like and a comment down below, and I will see you all in the next one. Peace out, guys.